at if you look at skate more it's a very straightforward skate video which is great there's like an intro and then and not even an opening like montage it's just an intro and then the first part right so we knew that because we wanted to keep it very kind of streamlined and and classic skate video like the only way to sneak in personality for these guys to make them stand out aside from their skating was to yeah like how their intros needed to ha show some of that stuff right, right. and yeah and some of them i think were better executed than others just because sometimes we, you know, we just wouldn't have like the footage for it you know or like for instance with day one's intro where he's like skate it's just his animation and he mm -hmm. he's kind of like doing one-footed manual shit on like you know the the pyramids at, in egypt and stuff that was because for me that whole slam sequence of him that opens up his video part of him falling like a, yeah, you know, a yeah. ton. that to me was like his personality thing sure. so it was like we couldn't double down on it so his 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 animation intro had to be kind of like uh, kind of silly but then i knew you were going to get way more day one personality right because up to that point i don't think anybody would seen day one slam yeah like you know mm -hmm. like i can't remember mm -hmm. seeing him fall in a video i don't think deca videos ever no, showed him not bailing really. or, no. and no. so for me when i started filming with him a lot he would, I would be like crying, laughing at his bail. I felt bad, like, you know, like laughing, <laughs> but he's so agile. He would always pop up, right? you know, like he'd say, roll right at yeah, it. Exactly. Yeah. So I realized it was okay to laugh because yeah. I'm like, all right, dude's cool. Like, you know, like, uh, yeah. Yeah. Um, but for me, that was like fascinating, you know, like I had never skated with somebody that could do that so gracefully, mm -hmm. I guess, you know, like I, when I fall, I've but I fall and I look like, oh, that guy's never skateboarded before. Yeah, no, he's just day one's not not affected by it at yeah. all. He'll they, fall all day, like bounce out of here, like, dude, what the? He's just like this stocky, this totally muscle and guy. And just boom, boom, boom. Yeah, like <laughs> exactly. You're, you're, you're like you're a sack of rocks, right? Just totally. Just boom, like yep. this, and day one's just bouncing all over the place. Dude. And I thought that was, I thought that was like cool to show. Like, you know, which I know maybe at that time still, this is pre-internet footage, right? Where now everybody knows everything about everybody. But at that time I was like, oh, is this kind of like a funny side of him that gets left in the edit room, <laughs> yeah, you know? Cause I'm sure Sock has like cool shit like this oh, from, you know, time. back in the day. Um, but yeah, so this was, so day one's kind of the only part that has this kind of long intro to mm -hmm. it that's not an animation but it's good though because i think i think at the end of the day like day one he skates very low impact right it's it's all manuals he, except where he makes it impactful because he right. skates like yeah. 30 miles but, per but at the end of the day like he slay he <laughs> takes he works for his shit he does he yeah, really takes some slams yeah. and i think that was the thing too right like uh again at this time this for me working on this part with day one because his previous video parts, like the second to none and like sneak preview and stuff, they were great, but they were so technical and so low impact. Even his uh, round three part came out like half a year before this. Um, they were so technical and kind of low impact that I almost felt like people didn't really know how hard he was working for the, some of this shit. Yeah. And, I, and that because we had chosen to film at all of these kind of, you know, left of center spots at the time, I think just putting the part together without seeing kind of what he went through would have been a disservice. Mm. Like you would have probably just been like, oh cool, they want rips. Like, and then that way you, going into his part right now, you're like, holy shit, this guy like is working for